Today, I'm gonna show you how to turn complete strangers into loyal paying customers in five core steps. We're back guys. My name is Frankie here from BTS TV Media and we're gonna be talking about the sales funnel, AKA the buyer's journey. We have content, lead magnet, tripwire, core offer, and the upsell. So for example, for content, let's talk about somebody who's trying to lose weight or get in shape. The first thing they're gonna do typically is just Google search it. Everybody does it. So the first thing they're gonna do is read a blog post probably that's gonna teach them how to get in shape. We're gonna do some jazzercise that'll keep you fit and smiling, sugar. And also there's video. So maybe they're trying to watch exactly what are those things of how to get in shape, but they're more a visual person. They would refer to a video. So the reason content's part of the funnel is because it's low commitment and it generates trust really easy. So we know they're trying to get in shape, but all of a sudden a pop-up comes up. Hello, fat ass. Ah! Hey, free webinar on you know how to meal plan. Now this person has already got trust from the blog post or the video they just watched on how to meal prep, so they'd be more likely to watch this webinar. And in order for them to watch the webinar, they'd have to make a little commitment with an email address or a phone number. So that would be the lead magnet, would be the webinar, a free PDF, something that's related to the piece of content they just consumed to provide that much more value. But it's a very low commitment. So at this webinar, they're gonna give you so much value, teaching you every little detail of steps on how to get a six pack, but just enough to where they don't provide you the tools necessary to get there. And the tools would be, let's say, they offer you 30 personal training sessions for 10 bucks. That would be an irresistible offer, AKA the tripwire. So after consuming this tripwire of the 30 personal training sessions for $10, it was so good that you got hooked. They gave you just a little bit of cocaine, now you're hooked for life and you want more. So that's where it segues into your core offer. And they're just gonna offer you all their services, personal training, meal prepping, strength training, weight loss, whatever personal trainers will offer you, they're gonna throw everything they can at you. So now look at where we're at in the buyer's journey. And if you're trying to make your own sales funnel, you gotta over deliver at every step to keep them wanting more. And that's where we get into the upsell. Whoa, you wanna provide me with some, some deals on some shakes and you know maybe some shakers and some gym gear? That would be the upsell. So look how we went from just reading a blog post to now I'm buying this person's attire, I'm eat, drinking their shakes, consuming all their content, all from just a blog. So after consuming all that content, now I love it so much because I'm such a big fan that I have to tell my friends about it. And usually that's where they put a referral program in place and now I'm referring people so I can get credit and now I'm a brand ambassador. Look, I know this could sound a little bit complex. You know, there's a lot of steps going on here but there's a book that really simplifies this. It's called Dot Com Secrets by Russell Brunson. We're gonna leave a link in the description below. Go ahead and check it out. But you're probably wondering, what about those people that fell off? What if they read the blog post and then they stopped reading? What if they did read the blog post and they did attend the webinar? You know, how do you keep pushing them through to the next step? And all of that will be glued together by advertising, retargeting. But don't worry, because we're gonna be talking about advertising, even content, and tripwires and all that stuff in future episodes. So stay tuned, follow us on social media, Facebook, YouTube, Instagram, all that good stuff, and we will see you. My name's Frank, thanks for watching.